like 1984. Get your iPod. iPod's here. You like your Macintosh. You like your Macintosh. Your Macintosh. Up, up. And the Macintosh of all the machines I've ever seen. Is My name is Aaron Crane. I work at Technorati. A thousand songs in your pocket. If today were the last day of my life, would I want to do what I am about to do today? So where are we here? So we are in historic South Park, which is what some might say the epicenter of Web 2.0. We're surrounded by a bunch of the well-known Web 2.0 companies. We have Twitter to our right, Six Apart just over yonder, Yahoo even moved in next door, and of course yeah. Technorati just down the way. Okay. What are you guys doing at Technorati? Well, Technorati, we specialize in a uh, real-time social media search. So we're telling you what's happening right now around the topics you mm -hmm. seek. And we do that by showing you all the user-generated media that's been uh, tagged or has the keyword of your search term, be it a blog post, a Flickr photo, a YouTube video, a podcast like yours, mm -hmm. so forth and so on. Okay. Why do people need Technorati? Well, it's really useful to get the sort of 360 degree view from the audience sometimes around an issue. Take for example the uh, Virginia Tech tragedy. As it was happening, 12 p.m. that day, if you went to Google because you wanted to know what was going on, you typed in Virginia Tech, unfortunately all you got were old web pages, authoritative web pages about Virginia Tech school, the football team, so forth and so on. Whereas when you went to Technorati and typed in Virginia Tech, you got blog posts from the students in their dorm saying what's going on this dorm you know I'm hearing gunshots from that dorm you got cell phone camera shots of bodies being dragged out and you got also news clips being uploaded okay. so you got a very multimedia experience of what was happening right then Okay. how did it all start with uh, Technorati uh, who was at the beginning well it was our founder and CEO Dave Sifri in his basement Thanksgiving writing some code so he and all his blogger friends could know who was linking to whom, basically. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And how, um, how does it grow since that, since, since that time? Well, basically he was working elsewhere at the time and this was just a little fun side project but got a lot of attention and as it grew I think he realized he'd happened upon something really big and more importantly something really useful okay. because I think that Web 2.0 is a meritocracy and the most useful services are the ones that become successful and if it's any indication of our, you know, utility, we're doing better and better every day. Okay. Um, do you guys cover only um, US centric or are you also looking at international things? I, is blogging US centric, you know? Do people in Europe upload photos and videos as well? Absolutely. Yeah. Yeah. And we are by no means US centric. Uh, the English language, even, yeah. is only by a small margin the most popular language, followed by Japanese and Chinese and all the European languages as well. Mm -hmm. Obviously, there's lots of events going on around the world, and there's lots of people out there telling their stories through user-generated media. Mm -hmm. The war in Iraq, the elections in France, so forth and so on. And at Technorati, we show everything about those topics, okay. depending on what you want to know. Yeah. We were a podcast about Apple and I heard that um, Apple is for you guys pretty important. Yeah, Apple. I think I've heard of them. Yeah. Uh, no, seriously though, um, since the word iPhone was coined, it's been one of our most popular search terms and Apple is a constant source of, you know, conjecture, rumor, hearsay, which is all excellent fodder for user-generated media. Mm -hmm. Apple's also kind of a media company because of their commercials, their, their I'm a Mac, I'm a PC commercials are very popular, they're very well done, they're uploaded to YouTube, they're passed around the internet, and you know, they have spoofs as well, people making their own versions, mocking, you know, whatever, Microsoft, you know, responding with its own commercials, and all that stuff is searched and surfaced via Technorati when mm -hmm. you type in Apple. Mm -hmm. Um, do you have some um, partnership with some other companies, like uh, you've mentioned, for example, uh, videos on YouTube? Are you working with some companies like that? Yeah, well, we get, inf we get media from all over the internet, and I think that's one of the unique things that makes Technorati useful. The fact that we're platform agnostic, so to speak. We search across YouTube, Flickr, TypePad, WordPress, 
Blogger, MySpace. I mean, we try and index as much as possible okay. because, you know, there's great stuff coming from all different corners of the yeah, web yeah. and we just want to be of service. Yeah. I think there's this Technorati score or Technorati percentage that some people have. Can you, can you maybe explain a little bit? Well, our core users are very devout, very dedicated, very opinionated, and they can be very demanding, but with good reason, you know? They've treated us very well. We like them very much, and we're constantly striving to help them out, be of service to them, to help out with their distribution on the web, because a lot of their audience comes through Technorati. We love them very much, and we hope they keep doing a great yeah. job. Yeah. What's, what's the future for Technorati? Well, I think the future is in social media, making it more social, making it more about not just the content, but the people behind the content and the okay. people around the content. You know, without the people, it's just media. The social aspect is the fact that blogs link to videos, and videos are found in profile pages, and photos, so forth and so on. It's all a giant dialogue, it's all a giant conversation on the web, and Technorati's unique service is bringing that all together on one page. Mm -hmm. okay. okay, so I think you might uh, give us a little walk here uh, somewhere where we are, and we're gonna check some, some companies here, right? Yeah, I'll give you the dime tour of uh, Web 2.0 town, so okay. follow me. Okay, let's go. So we're a couple of blocks away from where we were in Salzburg, and uh, where are we? Like As I was saying, this is uh, Web 2.0 Town USA, approaching on the right in about 10 yards. We're going to see a uh, pretty well-known company that I'm sure a lot of people in Europe know and love. It's called Six Apart. Yeah. And here we are. So. This is Six Parts main office. Okay. Vox Live Journal type hat. Okay. Type the uh, the bloggers' choice. We love yep. them very much. Yeah. And there's plenty more to see around here. Now we're walking by the uh, newest location of Yahoo, who has just got some office space right here somewhere. Okay. The only thing about Yahoo is, I think they like to keep a cover because I'm yet to see a giant Yahoo sign on any of the <laughs> buildings in my neighborhood, but I know it's within about a uh, 20 meter, Okay. Yeah. notice how meter. I didn't say yards, yeah, yeah. meter radius yeah. of where we are right now. So we are approaching uh, Technorati offices. Yeah. Headquarters, yeah. Technorati, so, um, USA. How much guys are you? Right now, we're in the high 40s, I want to say somewhere approaching uh, 50. We're threatening to break the 50-person uh, threshold, which I think officially makes us no longer a small-sized company. Okay. That's, by the way, uh, for those who don't know, in Europe, pretty typical to, uh, to the US taking those elevators. Which I'm not sure where I thought for human beings at the beginning. Yeah, well, <laughs> we haven't always been this big, and we've actually been growing at a pretty steady clip since I joined. I know I joined about a year ago now, and we were in the low 30s at that point, okay. which means that we've basically increased our workforce by about 30 something percent. Okay. So, and counting. Still going. This is our hallway. This is where all the magic happens. That's our door. We go inside it all the time. Yeah. And now we're inside. Technorati Hello. offices. And that's that. That's cool. Yeah. So, show them a little bit. Hi. Is this your office? This is my office, and this okay. is where our tour of Web 2.0 Town is. Oh, uh, you have some some uh, some gizmos here. Yeah. Well, to do. Uh, I'm a busy guy. Some work. Okay. Thank you very much. Anyway. Um, see you soon. It was my pleasure. Yeah. Goodbye.